So hello, good evening everybody. Uh, let me introduce you um, uh, Igor Bezinovich and Ivana Pipal, the creators of the movie Micro Cassette, the smallest cassette I've ever seen. And uh, we have the situation here that the moderator that uh, was uh, mm, about to, to lead this conversation, uh, she has some technical problems. So um, we decided for this uh, super new concept of like uh, just the, the dialogue between these two creators of this movie, Igor and uh, Ivana. And I'm gonna just uh, disappear and I, <laughs> I leave it to them and uh, we will try if that works. Uh, anyway, uh, if, you, if the audience have any questions, they can still uh, ask you through the, through the tool called Q&A. If they click it, they can, they can type their question and you can answer. Or uh, they can just uh, click raise hand and then uh, ask the question through the microphone. That's cool. it. <laughs> That's it. Yeah. I'm sorry about these problems. And uh, now it's up to you guys. <laughs> Thanks for connecting. <laughs> and Thanks for this opportunity to make this uh, very unusual Q and A. It's the first Our time pleasure. I'll be at the Q and A with a. The, only with the person that I made the film with. So this next to me, uh, this is Ivana Pipal. She's an animator uh, from Zagreb. Hello. <laughs> this is just me. Guys, I'm gonna, uh, oh, sorry. I'm gonna turn off. I'm gonna turn off now. So it's just up to you. Bye bye. <laughs> bye. Thank you, John. So uh, and this next to me in this invisible space is uh, Igor. <laughs> Hi, Igor Bezinovic, uh, which I made film with a uh, film called Micro Cassette, the smallest cassette uh, I have ever seen. Yeah. yeah. We, I suppose we should just say a few things about the, the film. So we were working on this film for uh, quite a lot, for uh, more than five years. And uh, it's only uh, 19 minutes long. So Ivana, how do you feel about uh, spending uh, five years and making something that is so short, only 19 minutes? Is it a bit disappointing? <laughs> uh, well, I don't think uh, it's short because in my mind, it's uh, still a process that lasted five years, but uh, you can see the whole process uh, in just uh, 19 minutes, so uh, it's actually a really good feeling that uh, that you can uh, spend so much uh, time working and uh, growing through the process and um, being inspired to do uh, so much things and then you have this uh, product that is uh, not short for me, but uh, it's a, a closed universe. It's uh, something that uh, is um, great to watch and uh, has its life on its own with these festivals. Uh, yeah. It's, it's nice to, to have a finally finished work after so much time. And uh, I enjoyed working with you a lot on the film. I enjoyed working with you also. <laughs> I should uh, have a question, right? <laughs> uh, what, uh, what part of the... No, what is the film about? Uh, what, can you uh, tell the, the idea behind the film? Uh, I can, but I, I suppose we're doing this talk for people who have already seen the film. So. Uh -huh try to explain what, what we try to do. So uh, as you've noticed, uh, our dear viewers, uh, the film has many topics and the principal thing that we wanted to uh, discuss uh, is, um, here comes our host. Uh, the principal thing that we wanted to discuss was uh, randomness and uh, giving a tribute to some very, very random uh, uh, thing. Uh, I lost Ivana now as well. I'm on my own. Uh, 
so we wanted to make a film uh, about uh, giving chance uh, some meaning, taking something very, very random and giving it some meaning. And that's what we did with this tape. So at the moment, uh, I uh, see that I'm in the chat room with MFDF Yichava and with uh, Nadana Mladic. Uh, they are both have their videos turned off. Uh, and uh, I don't know where my co-author is anymore. This is one of the strangest uh, Q&As that I've ever been to. Here comes Ivan. Ivan, I was waiting for you. <laughs> hey. <laughs> Where were you so far? Uh, my laptop died in a second. <laughs> so I explained, I answered your question. Uh, so um, I can ask you now, uh, what uh, was your what is your favorite scene in the film? Uh, the pa the favorite uh, scene would be uh, the scene with the mysterious Japanese man. Uh, that is my favorite uh, part of the shooting and my favorite part of the film uh, in the end. And also a uh, part with the interview of the man working uh, on the junkyard uh, that doesn't know how to find the person uh, who recorded the cassette. That would be my favorite part. And yours? I would go uh, with the uh, all, all the parts actually in which we uh, like included different people in front of the camera uh, were pretty entertaining for me. Uh, yeah, but I can say that uh, the shooting that we had these five, four or five days that we had when we were shooting live action were something uh, really exciting for me because I usually come from a documentary world or a, more fiction world, and uh, for you, I expected since you're an animator that you would you would say that some animated scene is your favorite one. But you also said that the live action scenes are your preferred ones. Was it hard to animate these things? Uh, it wasn't hard, and I think uh, because I usually do animation, uh, that's exactly why uh, my favorite parts are not animation because. Animation is something I'm used to, and uh, I know how to do it, and uh, it's it's something that is part of my world. And uh, this was uh, new and exciting, and uh, uh, we have chat from Dennis. <laughs> what does he say? Uh, I'm not sure. Teresa is trying to join, uh -huh. I think, our moderator. Ah, she's not that I'm Yeah, I wanted to, to ask you about an anecdote, to, to tell us an anecdote, because uh, after our premiere in Sarajevo, you received a very uh, interesting uh, message from a Japanese guy. And uh, it's, it reminded me because you mentioned that the scene with the Japanese man in our film is the one that you like a lot. And you also got uh, uh, a strange uh, fan mail from a, from a Japanese uh, audience member. So can you tell, tell us more about that? Uh, well, I don't know what to say exactly because I mean, it was, uh, I got the message that was uh, kind of random for a uh, Japanese uh, uh, writer. He's a writer that uh, saw our film and uh, he was really uh, uh, excited about it. And uh, he was uh, really happy that we uh, have this Japanese 
he said it, mysterious Japanese man and um, and uh, he was uh, really happy that we have a part of the film that uh, uh, that is in Japanese with the Japanese titles so he really uh, he thanked us that we uh, even made this film and uh, it's really nice thing to uh, got, uh, get this kind of messages because then uh, it seems it was all worth it. Would you say that <laughs> Japanese had uh, some romantic ideas about you? Because he didn't write to me, he just wrote to you. I think it's uh, because you're not on Facebook. <laughs> I, was, I was jealous because we are co-authors and then we have this Japanese fan mail and he's only writing to you. Uh, how how is um, how do you feel about uh, working uh, like this uh, in co-authors uh, way with someone? Will you uh, try it again with someone else? Oh, I tried it before with someone else. It didn't work. So with you working with you in these five years, it was a very long process. But it was, I think, when you work with a person as a co-author. Uh, you really have to want to make a film with this person and I really wanted to make the film with you uh, to explain to the audience. Uh, I knew even has worked from before because she has some amazing illustrations and uh, some um, artwork which are not really uh, audiovisual but only visual mostly. So not, not in the sphere of film but more of new media. Uh, so yeah, I wanted to work with you and uh, I knew that with this project we are not in any kind of rush, so that was, that was nice just to take our time and to, to see where the process will take us. And that's, I guess, the, the reason why our, uh, why, why our film is so eclectic, we can say, uh, is because we allowed ourselves not to follow a specific starting idea and then just to direct it, but we let ourselves uh, in, to be a part of the process. We weren't concerned so much about the result, more about the process. That's what I love about this whole thing. Do you think that uh, we asked uh, ourselves enough questions and that our Czech hosts are happy with the thing that, that uh, did we feel, fulfill their expectations? Uh, I'm not sure. I didn't. Uh, I think uh, we are talking for ten minutes now. I think we <laughs> we said a lot of things, but for me it's strange to talk to you in English because usually we speak in Croatian. Yeah. yeah so it's strange that we are now using some different <laughs> form of expression. Maybe we can. Do you speak any other foreign language? Um, no, I speak just uh, just English. But do you think we can try to speak non-verbally? Uh, I I do speak a uh, uh, visual language. I'm trying to uh, develop a language uh, that is uh, purely visual with my drawings. Ah. But do you think that you, uh, you could express your thoughts with through pantomime? Um, no. And you? I don't think so. <laughs> but uh, yeah, we can, we could try it. So I can, uh, for example, uh, make something with, uh, with my body and then you have to imagine which uh, part of the film I am, uh, I'm uh, acting. <laughs> okay. So I will now perform one scene from the film and you tell me which scene it is, and then you can do the same. Okay. So this is the scene that I'll do. <laughs> That's really easy. <laughs> yeah, because I wanted a simple task. So which scene was it? Uh, it was a scene um, of making the micro cassette, this mysterious Japanese man. Uh, Bingo. You have one thing. Right. Okay, let's see your scene. And that will be our final thing. <laughs> uh, wait a minute. Um, I will. Hmm.
I'm not sure I can do this uh, scene. <laughs> I don't have the prop that I would like to have, but I will try to um, just like this. Mm -hmm. Ah, it's uh, it's uh, Zoki lifting the pigeon. Yes, bingo. With the pigeon. So yes. It's one point for me as well now. So it's one, one. Hmm. And uh, I think we entertained our uh, audience uh, quite a lot. So, uh, dear hosts, uh, how uh, did we do? Are you satisfied? Are, is, are you listening to us? We have uh, three uh, smiley uh, and yes a message. <laughs> where, where, where do you see this? You have a Q and A uh, button. Got it. So this is great. Sh Show us more. <laughs> okay, we'll continue with the uh, with the pantomime uh, game. Okay, which scene is this? Is it the scene with a uh, round uh, hypnotic uh, animation? Hypnotic circle. Yes. Wow. Mm. You're the one. Ah, it's a uh, Zoki floating in space. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you too now. Mm. So. It should be harder. <laughs> yeah. uh, so the first one that reaches three points wins. And luckily enough, it's me. It's my turn. So if I uh, do it now, I win. Uh, which scene is uh, uh, which scene is this? I'm finished. It's a scene when. Uh, uh, one of the girls <laughs> is uh, 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 making, uh, talking to the tape animated. No. So, it's a so point. this point for me. It's for you, okay. Then you win. Ah. <laughs> mm. uh, Carol, uh, I hope that uh, that, <laughs> that was enough. Uh, we are uh, slowly uh, concluding this talk. So. Mm. If anybody's uh, listening to us, uh, just uh, from the moderator side, can you just please uh, appear and uh, conclude this conversation? No. It was here. Hello, guys. Hey. <laughs> Thank you, thank you, thank you very much. Yeah. I think it was just marvelous um, presentation, <laughs> very physical uh, presentation of your work, <laughs> <laughs> and we really appreciate it. I think Karel enjoyed it a lot. Who is Karel? <laughs> Me. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah, thank you, thank you for pushing us to, to do more. Yeah. Okay. Anyway, um, I think I'm gonna I'm gonna just uh, stop stop recording now. So I unpause it. Now you can say bye. No, no, I wanted to say bye to the audience. I know, but I paused it at the time. So now you have uh, another opportunity to say it. You wanna do it? Thank you for listening to us and uh, seeing our pantomime game, and hope you enjoyed the film. And thanks for your patience. Also, yes. <laughs> Thank you. Goodbye. Bye. Bye.